for it, but being just mouth wide open, agape. I mean, agape. We got a lot of, lot of synonyms, synonyms here. Uh, hey, hey, I, all right. <laughs> mouth agape. <laughs> You're like this, watching, uh, like, how is this even possible? Like, right. really watching a guy elevate to the next level. And I spoke to him on Wednesday, um, and he talked about distance between him and Max Holloway in making sure that nobody questioned who the rightful winner was anymore. He did that, man. He did that and more on Saturday night because every single time Max tried to mount offense, he was right there to put him in his place, stop it in his tracks, and then head back down the path of him just dominating. And I don't know what he saw in the prep, but you could see from the very beginning that he was operating on a different level. Because yeah, like you he said, he was speaking to Max from minute one. He was like yep. talking to him like, whoo, that one's there. That was close. You better be careful. It's like he just was like in, he was like in the zone. Like it was like when Michael Jordan made all those three pointers and he was like, I, I don't I have no yeah, idea what you said. Know, right. He's like, this, this, this doesn't normally happen. He's like, this, this. that's what happened to Alexander Volkanovsky. And when a guy is doing that, you really have no chance. And he dominated yeah. Max Holloway in a way that nobody ever could have expected. Stockton's finest, Nate Diaz, he's coming to check out Sugar Sean, right? Nah, you better watch the tweets about my little five recently. Oh, I know. There's always going to be a recipe for... Sean Strickland made a lot of mistakes, though. You know, he didn't go for... I thought that, you know, Sean is decent on the feet, he's very good on the ground. The, the in-between was lacking. Uh, walking him down, trying to jab him down against a guy like that it was always going to be a recipe for disaster. And, uh, yeah, Alex Pereira once again got the job done. And, well, everyone thought that Sean Strickland was, like, tricking us when he was saying, no, nah, I'll stand with that guy. And people were like, oh, he's lying. Like, I, he ain't lying.